Hello, students. It's about time that I unleashed your creativity. And so we're going to do this uh, this week with this concept that we're working with, which is the uh, different political systems. Now, you guys have a small group there, and I'd like each one of you to take a political system, take one of the political systems, and run with it. Now, don't do representative democracy. That's the United States. You guys are familiar with that. I want you to branch out some. But we're going to create a six uh, slide Google Present or Prezi or PowerPoint, whichever format that you're more comfortable with. And we're going to uh, describe one of these political systems. Now, I just made a little template that you can look, uh, you can look on this at, at this whenever you want for some ideas or some instruction. I'm going to start out with my type of government, which is representative democracy, and I put example there to make sure you knew that this was an example uh, Google Present. This is a Google Present format, which I'm not real familiar with. I'm, I'm learning, it, learning it as we go. So the first slide just has to uh, identify what your system is and certainly your name. The second slide, I would like from the second slide forward to have some type of interesting image there. And as you see, very little text. I don't want these bullet points flying in. We're going to try to put a voiceover on these slides this week. So what I'd like you to do once you find your neat image is put it on the slide and then just make some bullet points on a sheet of paper that you could read when you do your voiceover. So in this slide, I'm going to talk about the characteristics of representative democracy. With each one of your presentations, I'd like you to have an example. Uh, now, you could put a map of the world up with your country there, and that's fine. Or you can find like a really neat image which represents your country, and here I have the United States of America. Uh, in this slide, what you would do is you would give some information about the country. Like you might say the United States was founded in 1776. It has 300 million people. Uh, has the largest uh, gross domestic product in the world. Uh, it's an example uh, of representative democracy and capitalism and freedom that attracts many immigrants. I mean, those are some things that you could put down. Now, this is important. Your example can be from history. You can talk about a country or empire that no longer exists. That's just fine. In the next slide, uh, and you're free to borrow this image, it's a, it's a public domain image, I'd like you to talk about the strengths of your system. Now, you know what, I'd like you to find your own. Only use mine as a last resort. So here you want to make some bullet points. The strengths of my system is bam, 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 bam. And those are the things that you're going to read on your voiceover. And the opposite of that is the weaknesses. So you're going to have a slide on the strengths of your, economic, or your political system, a slide on the weaknesses of your political system. And finally, this is, a cool, uh, this is a cool slide where you talk about your perspective on what it would be like to live in this political system. So that, folks, is our uh, presentation. And like I said, six slides. You want to have a title, and then you want to address each one of these topics. All right?